in. Welcome to the G spot. I'm Big G. Please excuse the mess on my desk. I'm um, I'm uh, part way through an electronics project I'm making a video for, but this huge bag from Timu wound up on my front step, so we'll open this and get it out the way. This is the um, cheap ass opener I bought from Timu, and it was in a previous mailbag. It works really well. Okay, I'm going to move this out of the way and pull out individual parts. <laughs> Another type of box cutter that I want to try. Th these, I'll get down the bag. I always have a couple of these around, particularly in the car. I haven't got the greatest teeth in the world, and what this is, is a toothpick, a metal toothpick. And I couldn't tell you the number of times I've used these when I've needed a toothpick, particularly in the car. They're probably not a bad mini weapon either. Anyway. Right. So that's going to go out in the car. I lost part oh, of my this last parcel. One. Seen better days? Well done again, Australia Post. I'll get this open and then I will ooh, get it out of the way and put up the individual components. Now I'm doing things a little bit differently at the moment rather than open every parcel on camera because I'm buying a lot of gifts for my grandchildren and a lot of stuff for my other hobbies at the moment. So I'm just going to pull out what's relevant to electronics and show those. So these, this is just, this is from, not sure, I'll put that in the video in a minute. Some microfibers, I like to have lots of them around for cleaning my camera lenses and glasses and what have you. And this, and what have you. And this, oh, is a cheapy barcode scanner. Again, can't remember where I bought this, but it's supposed to be plug and play. Yeah, as you can see, it's a USB powered and connected barcode scanner. Also, it's supposed to scan QR codes. Uh, we'll do a test on that in another video. And we've got a manual. 